Blah, 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 blah. Blue Knights on stand over there. No, I can't. It's not on. Am I, I am? What the hell, man? I can't hear myself. Oh, well. All right, so we're at, uh, we didn't update this yet, so we're having Salty Fun and Booty. I don't know why Booty's going Marth. Maybe he... I forgot what he told me about this. Like, he, Meta Knight does fine in this matchup, I believe. And, ooh, not getting the edge guard he wanted. What are you doing? Yeah, he deserved that. I don't know what you were doing. So, yeah, Booty's going to lose the first stock. Down throw, no combos. Nice story, Yoshi's throws are like uh, the sandwiches only you get when you go to a fast food restaurant. You don't want the combo. You just get the sandwich alone. It's like that. Oh, I wish he up tilted right there. All right, now he's going to up tilt. Take the stock. Yay, hey. All right, so it's even game. Uh, Booty has to play neutral. And he has to be careful with the way he recovers also. He doesn't want to um, go too antsy because Yoshi's love to throw that fair out. And joining me on commentary is... What's up? Numbers. All right, but back to the match. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, Booty was trying to do some cheesy stuff and, like, she'll break onto the stage, but Salty Fun's just going to throw him an egg and follow with a fair. Booty and is so cheesy. Yeah, he is. But Salty Fun plays Yoshi really funny. <laughs> <laughs> really, the only thing I see in Yoshi's are fair. I don't know. When I think of Yoshi, I like to think of Nair and Jeb. <laughs> that's it. That's Push it. the A button with nothing else. Let's go, Yoshi. Oh, an egg roll. I know he did not want to do that, but he's going to make it work. Truthfully speaking, egg roll is not that bad of a move. It's not. It's really not. Like the Yoshi mains keep decrying it, but it's good. Come on. Yeah, like, you're, if I you're know aware you when you egg throw, you can just run to the other wow. side of the stage. Egg to sour fair gets the kill. Yeah, and Booty's not sending correctly. No one sent no it correctly. Sent it correctly. Rest in peace. Well, we don't want to see Zeno's uh, winner right there. Who cares about that? The pass. Wow, is are pass. you gum, wow. Because it loves doubles, man. Wow, I, thought, I thought you said you were just taking a break from the Wednesday one. Wow. All right, but who cares about any of that? We're, okay. This is a Wednesday, though. And we're good. Yeah. So we're actually going to go to Yes, we're going to go to FD. Has begun. And finally, Booty's picking Meta Knight. I think this is a better pick. <laughs> Sloppy Especially fun. <laughs> Especially for uh, Booty's characters. Yeah, he, plays like, he plays three. Yeah, but his Meta Knight is the start. Oh, oh, yep. oh, Meta Knight. Ah, uh, yep, you got to respect the armor. Yoshi's like, I'm out of here. Forget it. Jesus, looking like Cloud. Yep. Wow. Nice uh, tornado anti with up tilt. Oh, oh. Forward throw. It's delicious. <laughs> Good forward tilt. So the thing about Meta Knight's, uh, what is it, his tornado and his dimensional kick, the reason he's able to land without lag is because the end lag before special fall can be converted between air and ground. That's why. That's why. That's interesting. That animation before special fall can go from the air to the ground. That's a really rare property for most specials, but Meta Knight's got it on two of them. Yeah, yeah, a lot of characters, some characters had it too. Mac does too. Only on a side B, however. But, uh, sort of, not really. <laughs> gonna get the unteckable spin and get down tilt to uh, choop, choop, choop. a B. I love that down tilt. See, now I have to question why Booty went Bard game one. Was he just messing hey, he, around, I wonder? Like, he wants to try it. I, I don't, I don't, I'm not sure either. He says something specific about that matchup. Oh. I think he feels more at ease because um, he has a better move pool than Meta Knight in this matchup specifically in terms of how hitboxes work. Oh, here work. we go. Yeah. Yep, that's it. Meta Knight. That's a regular. Game two goes to Booty. See, this is why he should have yeah. picked Meta Knight game and one. And look, a replay. Yeah, he, 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 <laughs> that's all he did. And it had to be untackable too. Yeah, and the chances are uh, a quarter, right? 30%. Yeah. Oh, 30. Oh, I thought it was 25. Nope, data miners have confirmed it's 30%. Ah, okay, okay. There's even a special name for it. It's like uh, spin fall or something like that. Mm. 
All right, so we're going to go to Battlefield. No DSR here, so screw that. Salty Fun says no thanks to those rapid jabs. I'm so, right. yeah. Booty likes to do that, especially when uh, people are holding their shields. Right. It's really good shield pressure. But if it's a hit, you might as well go for Shuttle Loop. Tornado is in a true string. For sure. Another egg roll. Now I have to wonder if they're on purpose. Oh. Oh, be oh, careful. Nope, don't air no! dodge. Oh, Salty Fun, wow. be careful. I'm amazed that he dropped Wow, that. another one. Like, I see him getting some success using it, but egg roll is like eight damage or something. Oh, really? That's it? <laughs> well, I saw him go from 80 to 86, but it's stale at this point. <laughs> careful, buddy. Yeah, but he's going to get the... What was that thing called? What? When he doesn't get lag from the special. There is no... Oh, it's, it's there just There is lag. no name for it. Okay, okay. Uh, the lag can just be converted between air and ground. All right, so let's just kind of all... Can't. Please tell me you know how to mash. Oh, God! Fair spike right out of shuttle loop. Yeah, he was impatient right there. I thought he was very patient. He used all of his jumps before using up B. Yeah, but he should pay attention. Oh, oh my God. Yeah, no shield pokes. Yo, weather the storm. <gasps> wow. Very nice. Salty yeah. Fun getting a very Frame handsome traps. string. Wow. Well, you see, that, that's great and all, but Booty can return to favor and kill. Perhaps. We'll see. Yeah, he just needs to rack up about, like, uh, 30%. Like he actually knows the exact numbers for no. each character. You know who's at kill percent right now? Salty Fun is at kill percent yeah. right now. Yeah, yeah. You know who's feeling himself? Salty Fun is feeling himself. Oh, yeah. Salty Fun's also at kill percent. Don't get kicked. All right. Salty Fun is 100% aware that he could die right now if he gets kicked with that angry Meta Knight. Yeah. That's, that's like chilling the leg. Oh, he's not going to do it that one He's not going to try it. Oh, he Missing tried well. it, but he's dead. Pack it up. He tried to finish it off right there. I, he, the, the he wanted easy, it. Yeah, the easier way to tell that was going to work is that if the camera zooms in towards him. And what do you, you mean? See, you see, if it, it's not zoomed in that close, but in the first game it was a, it was zoomed in a lot closer between on them. And the blast, I don't know what. No, it worked. He did hit both hits. It just didn't kill. And here's that. This was beautiful. <laughs> yeah, I wish he drill rushed instead for that. Oh, yeah. Now, what were you saying about the... Oh, my God. This was so handsome, too. Look at that. Oh, yeah. That was nice. He was at 30%. That's right. Now he's at 80. Let's watch that one more time. Yeah. Yoshi, the damage <laughs> juggernaut. <laughs> You're kind of feeling yourself on this one, huh, Salty Fun? Woo! Very nice. <laughs> Meanwhile, we got Bankai. And but what uh, were you saying about the uh, shuttle loop zoom-in thing? He like got I, both hits to connect. You know he meant that, right? that if yeah. Salty Fun had died, he would have uh, it would have zoomed well, yeah. in specifically on Meta Knight. It wouldn't have stayed zoomed out. Yeah, because it, it, well, game, obviously. Game two, it was a, it was zoomed in a lot closer than it was that time. I mean, the cue is they suddenly disappear out of the magnifying glass. Yeah, it's like they're in the magnifier, then they just disappear. Wow, we got an interesting tag. Bon Kai versus. Um, let's uh, let's take that very close. Oh, he del he deleted it. That was. Uh, okay. Never mind. Mwah. Mundi. Mundo. Yeah, Fang and Bankai. Bankai Fang. won this last Wednesday, right? Yeah. Yeah, Bankai won our Xeno Weekly. How dare That's he? Nice. Oh, how do you feel about that, huh? God damn it, Bankai. Yeah. Darn, darn, darn. I wasn't there to stop. Numbers, <laughs> do you want to play your, your match now? Sure, I'll go play my match. All right, you're All fighting right. Mainwolf. Bye, everyone. All right, so I'm going to do a little solo commentary by myself. Yay. Oh, wait, no, no, no. I have Salty Fun right here. Yeah, he's going to join me right now. <laughs> Hey, Booty, you suck.
so I hear Donkey Kong died. Yeah, that's what I heard right now. All right, so here we are now. We apologize for some technical difficulties right there, but we are now joining you here. This is Munel versus Bankai. I'm curious what happened that first stock because right now Munel actually has the lead. And a oh. uh, little bit of history about Bankai, he won Xeno this week. Yeah, I'm actually dumb. I thought that was Fang. I don't know why. Something's wrong with me. I apologize, you know. All right, so yeah, 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 yeah. He did one like um, Wednesday. I mean, it makes sense why he would go Donkey Kong. Munel, of course. Normally, we see him bust out the. Uh, Ooh, yeah! Don't let Bankai trip you up with that. Yeah. He loves using that up B. He loves. There are two things he loves doing. One is that up B out of shield, and the second one is the shield pressure with that up B. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Right there, he does the spot dodge, gets the up B kill pretty early, also. Yeah, it was a little impatient on Munel's part. Like if he up, like he should just wait for whatever option he has, because most of the time he's not gonna be able to punish down smash. <laughs> most of the time. <laughs> <laughs> Munel not even touching the Wario today. I, I feel like he that matchup. Wario? <laughs> oh no! Munel plays Wario. Huh. But anyway, now we are here. All right. Really patient start at the beginning here. Yeah. yeah. Oh. All right, getting back into it. We actually have Bankai getting the first opening up of the combo there. Nice 23%, but, you know, that's nothing for Donkey Kong. Of course. The big issue, though, is that he is so big and he gets juggled so hard by ZSS. But honestly, Donkey Kong's huge size, which is norm like huge weight, which is normally one of his uh, biggest assets in his kit, is just totally useless against ZSS because she just kills him. He would probably die right now. Nice. Oh, he, he tried to read an air dodge. Like, I, I don't agree with that because it was guaranteed in, to begin with. I'm not sure if it was. I really? I just I sort of assume that Bankai knows the percents of everything. Keep in mind, you know, up air was nerfed, you know, during one of the last patches. Yeah. And it does make those up B strings a lot in more inconsistent and a really smart getting him with the down smash on his recovery, punishing with the down B for that first stock right there. And Bankai with aggressive when he is in the um, positive position. Oh, so just Bankai, I feel like every single time he starts off with a new stock and his opponent's at zero, he always gets like up air to up smash. Like every single time. I don't know. Maybe it's his good luck charm. Oh, really nice. Getting the Nair back air. Oh, what a smart usage. <laughs> That was pretty sneaky. That was that was honestly really sneaky. Like he, he actually used the um the tethered ledge grab to his advantage because it has less like I think you can act out as se after seven frames after grabbing the ledge. Yeah, no, yeah. you can. It's you do not have to grab ledge as long as other characters. Yeah, and also just it's the tricky movement. It throws yeah. him off. He's not expecting you know that sort of like I wasn't expecting it. I don't think anybody was. He goes down there. It looks like he's trying to cover low recovery and then boom he's already at the top yeah, of the screen. Yeah. Punish him. You know reacting in time so and Donkey Kong doesn't really have the best in that position he, did, he didn't have like a quick option out of that. Quick option is up B but uh, he was already on up so high he wouldn't be able to do anything about it. So yeah I think we're having Jash. Yeah, that's Ash is here. Oh. Oh, no, that's Station 1. Um, hold on a second. I need to go quickly get a tissue. Okie dokie. Yeah, no, no, no. So, yes. Pretty weird that we're having this on a Saturday. But it's understandable. There's not much going on on Saturday, so, yeah. Yeah. So yeah, I'm, we're going to have SN and Jash. I played SN in doubles, and I played him sometimes in singles. Yep, yeah, here we are. We're going to adjust a little bit of controls right now. So yeah, we're going to have a Pikachu and Toon Link, I believe. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. I, I, don't, I don't know if uh, Jash or SN has any secondaries that they would. But they... they um, 
they really utilize their mains really well. So I don't see, I don't see a reason why to uh, switch on any kind of secondary whatsoever. Yep, and of course, DA Dash. We we haven't seen him here in Zeno in a while. Yeah, no, no. A very strong tune link player, possibly the strongest in New York. You know, there are a couple of the contenders. I know Shy Guy, um, you know, my crewmate Sketch does very well. But honestly, Jash, I remember that he almost got into top eight at Defend the North. He's a very solid player. And we'll see how, I think that, I think that movement is going to be so key. Yes, it you is. Know, yes. If Chu is so good at zone breaking, oh, yeah. but all he needs to do is mess up once, and Toon Link's conversions, even on a light, small character like Pikachu, are devastating. Especially considering that, you know, after about 80%, bomb forward air is a thing. Yeah. Uh, another thing about this matchup, uh, um, I think that SN could keep keep things close and not like try to go too far, like at that that distance, because he can actually he's like Pikachu is one of the few characters that can actually pull, punish Toon Link for bomb pulling, and he has the frame data to uh, yeah like that. He has the frame data to uh, come in closer and do whatever he pleases. Whenever Jash throws out a laggy move like Boomerang. Ooh, but there we're seeing that big punish. Only 23% that time, and Jash decides to go for a hard read, and Smash Nintendo manages to drift far away enough that it doesn't connect. And oof, I'm actually liking the very defensive style coming out from Smash Nintendo. Yeah. Normally, you see Pikachu's in this matchup, in general, those fast zone breakers try and stay on top of Toon Link all the time, trying, you know, just basically put on constant pressure. But Smash Nintendo is dead opting. You see a lot of these thunder jolts running away, and then he, at the very opportune times, will quick attack through right there. But that was a little bit questionable. Jash getting the power shield means he can actually punish it with the bomb pull. Yep. Keeping it slow. And like these characters. Ooh, that no tech. That was, actually, punished. that was a really cool tech setup from Jash, and the fact that Smash Nintendo didn't land it meant that that forward smash ends his stock incredibly early. And now we're probably going to be seeing a lot more of an aggressive play style from SN. Yeah. Mainly because he can't really afford to just hang back and, uh, you know, throw those T-jolts when he doesn't have the lead like that! Oh, Ooh. good height from Tilling Suppy living that. Ooh. Goes for the uh, up throw thunder, but it doesn't quite connect. I'm loving how Smash Nintendo is throwing out these up airs, and he's both catching the bomb. Wow. What a smart. That was so that was so brilliant from Jash. Like you knew that he he had that actual timing down, uh, and the bomb actually bursts at the exact right moment, saving his skin right there. And he's holding on to the stock right now, trying to put in as much chip damage as possible. One of the issues we're seeing at the moment for Smash Nintendo, Pikachu historically has some really hard times killing. Mm -hmm. His uh, his aerials don't really kill except for down air. You know, he doesn't really have a kill throw, but uh, air dodge read on that thunder will close it out. That was really good positioning. Like if he if he was not in that exact same spot, he wouldn't hit him. Yeah, no, that was really great read. Not only on the air dodge, but also the drift. Um, and Smash Nintendo is down by about 53% with three minutes on the clock. We're probably not going to see a timeout be a factor, but these two players definitely have to be conscious of, you know, who needs to approach. Mm -hmm. Smash Nintendo very aware of that at the moment, getting some nice damage and almost evening it up. And I like that he's approaching with a uh, short hop down here. It's really good on shields. And if you know, if you're aware that um. Your opponent's gonna shield drop after you do the first hit of downer. You could just fast fall and get the the landing one. <laughs> oh, nice. gonna the up air there. Yeah. I think he wanted a B reverse T jolt. Yeah, but in keep, the end, he keep. still has a one percent lead, and he can actually play to this now. We're starting to see a lot more of that defensive T jolt style. Yeah. When oh, that, that bomb is actually gonna blow up on the T T ball and hurt him. Yeah, they're so even right now, but you have to keep in mind what respective kill percent means for both of these characters. 
uh, Pikachu. We didn't see him uh, take out Dash's stock until 150, like well, like 170 last time. Whereas, you know, with one air dodge, we Dash closed out. You know, Smash Nintendo stock at like 60. That might be it. Yeah, air dodging into the ground. Dash has been looking for that this entire set and or the entire game rather. Finally, gets it at the right moment for Bomb Fair. All right, so I'm actually, it's it's funny. So Josh, Josh won that game, but he won it off of two really big reads. The first one yeah, was no. that first stock, which was huge. Um, Lilat was most likely banned, and so we're going to be seeing uh, Battlefield instead. Yeah, you want to you ban Lilat against Pikachu. If you don't have a character that can keep up with him or just have a move that he just, that you could just throw out, Whenever he does quick attacks, you're not gonna you're not gonna get a good punish. Yeah. And it'd probably be especially if you go for Toon Link, considering how much of a zone breaker that up B is. Yes. If he was able to do it even more freely with you know throw a real wrench. Ooh, nice conversion there. Still and Smash Nintendo, great job getting back down to the ground. Pikachu can be so hard to keep in disadvantage because of just the sheer amount of angles and options he has with that quick attack from coming back down to the ground. All right, uh, Denner was not going to be safe. If he, if he had fastball, it, it probably would have. You can see right there, he did it. Yeah. It's really cool that Smash Nintendo recognizing the shield drop, going for the mix-up where he ends up uh, between the fastball and the power shields from Smash Nintendo. Ooh, but he jumps empty into that waiting Toon Link up tilt. He has to land. All right. And, and this so is, I see another, this is another problem that I see with this matchup. Whenever uh, SN gets a hit, he has to like get three more while Toon Link has to get two. Yeah, I mean that's always kind of the case with Pikachu, but yeah. one real cool adaptation we're seeing from Jash is he's doing a lot more of these quick hitboxes. You know, before he was like doing bomb pill, like you know, throwing out like an angled boomerang. Now it's like he's trying to throw it as many moves as possible to wall Smash Nintendo out. It's actually a great adaptation. <laughs> Rolling back to back all the way to the ledge. Yeah, and now we're seeing him start to look more for these bomb setups as opposed to just this, the simple wall outs. Yeah, we're not going to get the thunder. Yeah, he's right, getting walled out. Back throw, but not going to do it. Smash Nintendo right now on his last legs, but he's still in it for the moment. I think SN should not uh, hold shield for way too Yeah, that's going to be it. Yeah, no way he's going to survive the back throw that time. But already, now that Josh has the lead, yeah, we're starting to see again, he's throwing out a lot more of these patient, like, like, just like, throwing out a lot of hitboxes, but a little bit patience from uh, Smash Nintendo actually lets him get in there. I wish he had smashed out his shield instead, but that's not gonna matter. He's gonna get that confirmed with up throw to Thunder. Ooh. And we're seeing the uh, perfect pivot crouches. I wonder if Smash Nintendo is using PG. Uh, you can do it with a regular control like regular control set, perfect but it's really crouching? hard. Yes. Well it's like beyond frame perfect. It's ridiculous. Yeah. I like when I do it it's, it's completely by accident. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna grab the ledge the second time and get bomb confirmed on. Yeah, that was really good awareness from Jash. He recognizes that he had to. Okay, you have a match right now. I have a match? All right. What's that? All right, so we're actually going to have a commentator, Salty Fun, going on stream with his match. I don't know. Who is he facing? Oh, snap, it's Venya. <laughs> he grabbed the gauntlet and he put it on. Hey, hey, right. hey. What's up, guys? How many people do you have watching? Oh, Good amount? Decent amount? Alright. I'll take it. Even if I'm talking to myself, I'll talk. <laughs> Let's just talk. You're definitely not talking to yourself. I just don't know how many people you're talking to right now. Because <laughs> there are people in the chat like actually talking to each other. Okay. Which is very surprising considering how many events are happening today, dude. Really? Yeah. There's like one worldwide tournament plus like two majors happening oh. today. And people still tune in. That's loyalty. Oh my goodness. <laughs> People are still tuning in, making him cry. I don't cry because I'm too cool, but that's crazy. I mean, Little Mac, man. <laughs> I'm sensitive. I don't know what you're talking about. I see people playing other characters that are better than me. I ex I'm sad. <laughs> yeah, we're going to have to kill Sage and Salty Fun. Should be a button check? Yes. 
I remember when the stage was legal at one point. Not in this game, but back then. Hilarious. Yeah. Those were the days. Not really. Yeah, little button. This doesn't even look like a button check. They're not even pressing any buttons. Alright, now they're pressing buttons. Alright, there. So what's the capitalization on, on Car XM? What? It's a capitalization the capitalization on Car XM. What do you mean? Is Where that it? Where do you capitalize your name? Oh, no. It's just the way you do normally. K, and then lowercase for the rest. Okay. You should put it at the X. That's, like, cooler. Yeah, see, look, that looks... Nah, the way Helper had it was better. Change your name. Change your name. I don't want to be Malcolm X. <laughs> 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 who cares about my name anyway? You don't care about Venya. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right. Game numero uno. Town of City, Shikang, Yoshi. I don't know what, um, how familiar Sage is with this matchup. And we're going to play a neutral rather slowly. Yeah, pretty slow neutral so far. Yeah, seeing that Salty Fun doesn't want to commit way too hard because Sheik is going to punish him pretty hard, and that's a good example of that. Oh. Nice quarter. If I was Salty Fun, I'd just be trying to trade all day. Yeah. I'll trade with you. Yeah, that's one of Sheik's biggest problems. In fact, that yep. the fact that Yoshi's uh, more on the heavy side of things, yep. um, he doesn't have to deal with... He could just trade all day with Nairs. Every time he gets hit. He has the frame data for it, and he's, he's heavy and floaty. One of the few characters that's like that, so like, yeah. hard to combo him, and it's hard to kill him. You gotta like straight hit to kill him, and she doesn't have good straight hits for kills. Yeah, getting the tech chase. I, yeah, I felt like once I said that he was gonna like get bouncing fish off stage. Like once that, oh yeah, she's not gonna kill. He's gonna get like bouncing fish or something. Yeah, good on Salty Fun, aware that there's no 50-50, so he can just jump away. And Yoshi doesn't have all that much of a hard time landing, just getting back on the stage mostly. No, that air speed is pretty good. Yeah. Best in the game, so... I'll call that out. Oh, he wanted the ledge right there. The eyeing in, that was an up air. The down B? Oh, using invincibility on yeah. Spanish. Uh, wow, yeah. bouncing fishing right over the egg. I was actually just going to say, he's throwing too many eggs off stage, and she can't fly out there to get you, so... Yeah. Get a good example. He doesn't have to respect the oh, strength. He died. Oh, okay. <laughs> Damn. I know Sage was just mashing jump, but we take those anyway. So I looked away for like half a second. He, what happens? Yeah. Just watch. Look. Bam. Oh my God. The classic. <laughs> Pro. Sage looks mad stylish with that ponytail, man. That's really? a little ponytail. <laughs> Style. Should get some sunglasses to go with it. <laughs> Alright, game two. Battlefield. Oh, she's just dipping. She's not having none of that. Yeah, no. Down tilt, down tilt. Let's go. That's not real. Nope. Forward air. Okay. He went for more damage. He went for the nair. Yeah, like you said, he's just getting uh, one to two hits when she can get a lot more, but that armor and the fact that he goes yeah. into the frame through nair, he doesn't... He has to respect it. I feel like Salty Fun is actually kind of just not doing anything right now. Yeah. There we go. Now he's getting something started. But that bouncing fish away is not going to get anything more. Okay, he's getting face. Yeah. Keeping his jump as you show with any character with such a susceptible recovery. Nice job. Porter. I wonder if Salty Phone's aware that um, if Sheik and then, or other characters, if they are recovering uh, right next to the ledge, or like pr uh, parallel to the ledge or anything above it, yeah, you can't do from them. You can hit them. Really? No tech, not getting the tech chase. I mean, he still got something. No invisibility. Gonna go for Throw the eye in. Now, I think that if uh, Salty Funk can shield, uh, even better, perfect shield. Um, oh, okay, he's gonna get that going. That worked out. 
Yeah. He actually shot the egg the wrong way, and then he shot it the right way, and Sage was like, I'm, I like the situation, I'm gonna stay here. <laughs> yeah, what I was about to say is that if Salty Fawn can catch uh, the kill Sage rising fair, he could punish that with up smash out of shield. Yep. Oh, pivot grab. Oh. They're dodging for no reason. Up air couldn't have hit from there, she was too far away. He got away like the tip of Fortune, so that's not gonna combo. And that was a good retreat from Sage, knowing that he was gonna nair right after that forward tilt. I'm surprised he wasn't jabbed there. So, up air, I think he could've got another one. But I don't really play Yoshi. <laughs> forward tilt top smash. Yeah, that's the thing. She has this. Expecting an, uh, an air dodge landing. I mean, he, he has no reason not to go for it. He can't get punished for it. Yeah. And he has to just not throw any like for no reason. I know Yoshi's wanted to do that to recover and stuff, but you're fighting a character that can fly for you. Yeah, and I don't think it. Oh! See, if you threw an egg there, he would die again. Wait, like, did, did he not have to jump that whole time? That's what I'm wondering. Yep. Ooh, and that bouncing fish. Gonna take the stock. He just has to watch out with what he's pressing off stage. He's pressing like a lot of B reverse stuff and all this stuff that's unnecessary. If you have the best air speed, just float back on stage. That was pretty cool. Son versus Snakey on stream! But he's losing all these stocks because he's just like pressing stuff that he doesn't have to press. Yeah, you were right. He he was nowhere near that up air. He had no reason to air dodge for that. And he loses here because I think he tries to B reverse. Which is all extra, you don't need to do all that. You see? You don't need to do all that. That doesn't help Yoshi out that much, especially when they're out. You have the best airspeed, just drift away. That way you can react to Bouncy Fish and not be stuck in. Yeah, he, he wouldn't. If he didn't do that, he would have air dodged that. Definitely. Definitely. Yep. And let's say you would have punished, but you would have got back on stage. Yeah. It's crazy right. that you could like, just fly out there and, like, for some reason, it's just not committal. Like any other character flies off, throws their body at you. you you're like, oh yeah, I'm gonna kill him for that. But she, no. She's no. gonna throw her body at you and you gotta respect it. All right, so we're actually gonna have a uh, Snakey and Soan. You look drained. You look drained. You can't, you can't up your people and kill them for free, right? So that shit is, <laughs> you look drained. He's like, damn. <laughs> you just gotta play neutral for forever. Yeah, 100% of the time. So yeah, we're gonna have Snakey and Soin. Uh, if we play Soin in doubles. Yeah. Really nice, like. He's an Ike. <laughs> I'm kind of curious if he actually is gonna go Ike against uh, Snakey and Rosa. I'm pretty sure he's an Ike exclusive player. Really? I mm -hmm. think he's just solo Ike. I've seen him pull out Ness and Friendly, so I don't know if that's a character oh, yeah? he's trying. Yeah. Well, let's see if he boosts me wrong because, to my knowledge, this guy's Ike loyalist. <laughs> the top players here are complaining. Mm -hmm. I struggle with the same thing though. It's like, yeah, your fair looks strong, but it doesn't kill. I know, right? It's like <laughs> weird how that works. Okay, so we're actually gonna have ZSS inside. I haven't seen Sinky's Rosa in a while, actually. Nope, haven't seen a Rosa in a bit. She's in most of these zero suit. I think she's trying to focus on zero suit. Yeah, uh, Helper does say that uh, Sneaky said that uh, she wants to keep going with ZSS. Or what's it, Devin who told me that? Either way. That was me. Yeah, it was, that was on you. stream. Uh, she's trying to get back to that 2008 Sneaky who played ZSS. Which I respect. You know, go back to your roots, back to Brawl. But it's a different game, so you have to like keep that in mind. Mm -hmm. I heard something about ZSS can't kill in Brawl because like SDI or something like that, but. Anyways, oh wow, he just grabs him right off the bat. Ikes like to do that. They like to like just like jump, double jump, and there. Yeah, to try to hit you. Like they try to like bait you with the first jump and jump up, jump away. Which is good for a uh, player. See, he just tried it again too. Yeah, and like that playstyle is good for players that are not super patient. That playstyle works on people who are just like who tunnel vision you and they just go for the first thing they see because then you dodge it and then Ike hits you and he can confirm off that there pretty well. 
Like to me, that's what makes it good Ike Flair. You know how to do the double jump thing, but then you see it doesn't work, you know how to play without it. Because Ike, he's, he doesn't have to hit you too much. He just has to hit you a few times. So now, all your tricks only have to work at least once or twice, and then you're good, right? You need to do it the whole match. Yeah. Oh, missing the grab right there. Ike kill. Yep. That's Ike. I believe she chose DI in for that. I'm not sure if there's a DI that can save you for that. If you DI out, the forward air is guaranteed. If you DI in, it's a 50 50 on the up air. Really? Okay, okay. I'm going to start DIing in. But at lower percents, it's, it's a combo. Yeah, it is. That's, a, that yeah, that, that's what he likes to do, also. Yep. Trying to get a broad read. Ooh. Uh, that down B is actually going to save her, I believe. Saves you by three more percent. No, oh, that's too committed. Wow, you could have got a way harder punish. People don't take the punishes they should take in this game. Yeah. Like, I don't have any run up burst kill options. That's why I don't. But, like, if I had one, you best believe you do something like that. You're dying. Mm -hmm. And in that position, like, the only thing she really could have done that was quick enough to punish it was. She could have ran up up beat. She could have Oh, yeah, that's it. That's, that's what I'm saying. You can just do that. Yeah, that up going to kill this time. Even if enough time, maybe once you see him, don't even got to move. He's just down beat. Down be in place and go kick him. That's true. That's better than dash attack. No air dot. Oh. All right, he's just letting someone press all these buttons. I would see more. I would like to see more paralyzed. Just shoot it out. <laughs> oh, that's embarrassing. When you try to quit and you can't, so you gotta apologize for trying to quit. <laughs> Nah, but yeah, well, I'd like to see Snakey just shoot like a little neutral B. Because if he's doing that double jump thing, you can just shoot and catch his landing without having to commit. He like pretends he has a neutral. <laughs> yeah, How's his down tilt? His down tilt's alright. Yeah, it's pretty good. It just hits the ground only, so if people jump. <laughs> now, I'm going to let that slide, but you shouldn't talk again. <laughs> Don't forget about the ultimate tech. The, I'm going to up tilt out of shield, and you're going to run into this. Yeah, for some reason, like, that works. I, like, because it, it covers a lot really of airspace. Yeah. It's a pillar inside of him. Like, it hits the ledge, just like Foxes does. All right, so we're actually going to go to Battlefield. I like that. <laughs> See, like, in that, that moment, I would just shoot, like, a little thing at him. Yeah, not, like, not go too close. Yeah, because, like, you're just putting yourself in danger all the time. You don't have to. Like, a good mix-up for people is, like, let them think you're going to camp him. Because then mm -hmm. he's like, oh, he keeps shooting this, but that projectile's not even good, so now I'm going to get in on him, and then <laughs> that's when you do your thing. But people just go, the, the, oh, my projectile. Why Ooh. did that? Why didn't you go for it? I think that was guaranteed also. It was. Yeah. Trying to 50 50 when you have the combo. All right. I could just go on for things. Grounded. Oh, he's get, he got the air dodge read, but he wasn't in the right spot. See, just shoot it. Like, just shoot something at him. Don't let him come for free like that. That was going to be a free punish from that down B. Down B has a lot of lag. Shoot it. Oh my god, you're not doing it. All right, what's that? That's not going to kill. Shoot. See, like, you let him recover straight. Your projectile is not the best, no, but you have one, and he doesn't. Ah, uh, that's mine. way too late. Let me see, I can tell. And that actually had a lot of shield stun, so it's not going to be able to upbeat so much. All right, and he tried to challenge it and almost died. Yeah, but good DI from Sanky's case, and that bear's going to take it. Yeah, the same thing that happened. Oh, there, you there see, we go. The same thing one. happened. Just shoot a little one. Back oh, Todd, feel himself. Someone didn't like that. I can see it by his face. He did not like that. There you go. See, shoot a little one. That's what I was talking about. Because now he's going to start coming in like a madman. What the hell are you doing? <laughs> I can't believe he got away with that. Oh, my God. What's going on? All right. Let's just smash attack, guys. There you go, shoot a little one, like I said. You don't listen to me. I'm, I'm acting like you can hear me, right? <laughs> uh, 
Alright, in the ground. Up two. Okay, good wait. Yep. Like, I, I'm glad she didn't went down. Is that gonna? No. I'm, I, I'm overestimating him. <laughs> Why'd you? That S attack is really strong. Thank you. Oh, that was an up air. That was definitely an up air, and you could start it. Okay. And yeah, uh, being right through the stage. Yep. Just avoided definitely. That was definitely a back air. Yeah, so the middle. Snakey's just not punishing. Yeah, she's scared. Just not punishing. What? Oh no, yeah, I know. I know. Also under uh, under the stage. It hits under the stage. I know. Down tilt or up tilt? Up tilt. Wow. It's like, like I said, he just wants to be like other characters. Like, the fox does that, but it's like, mine doesn't <laughs> kill, but I'll upper you and then back air you and then. But Ike's just like, watch this, but then if he misses it. <laughs> this guy's throwing things at me. Yeah, I think he wants to do that because he throws shurikens at him. I think so. <laughs> Freaking nut. Uh, oh, oh, help. Where'd the helper go? Oh, he. he all right, so Sage is taking over. Hi, Sage. He's not going to talk to you. That was good. Uh, nah, see? <laughs> see? See? Why are you making me look dumb? Mm -hmm. <laughs> we're really out here. It's 2017. <laughs> back, on my, back on our bullshit. So, yeah, we're going to have us. Oh, I don't have to check the bracket. But <coughs> but it is right here. So, we're going to have Helper and Kaizen. Yo, baby, Goat Silver, thank you for the two bits. We will uh, not do shit with that. <laughs> Yo, I'm weak. And the guys upstairs are laughing like they're part of it. No. <laughs> Alright, I see Helper with Luna. So I'm guessing we're gonna see Kirby versus Cloud. whatever. I think Cloud. Versus one of his 10,000 characters. Facts. Helper has a lot of characters. I'm waiting for him to pick one already. I feel like Helper just doesn't give a shit. Probably not. Oh my god, I'm logged into the house account. Finally. Yo, peep this house tweet. Oh god. I'm not even gonna check my Twitter because if I check it, it's gonna be like I'm gonna be like co-signing with that, sh and then I'm like, like, no. If you do something wild <laughs> that like ruins all the house's reputation, and I watch it now, I'm gonna be part of it. So. <laughs> I'm just gonna check it safely in like two hours or something. Diddy Kong, Kirby. Oh, Diddy versus Kirby. I thought he dropped Diddy. I don't know how this matchup is, but I can imagine Kirby's like just too slow to do anything, like most yeah. of his matchups. Yeah, Helper can monkey flip for free. So I believe we're actually gonna go to um, FD. That's what I think right now. Oh no! Oh. Down. Yep, down. At least Kirby has up throw. Oh yes. At least. If he has one thing, he has is up throw. Yeah, and in certain spots in the stage, it's just can you get the grab? <laughs> like yeah, it's, it just comes down to that. The problem with that is that Diddy can kill, <laughs> has to kill throw as early if by the ledge. Diddy throws his kill confirm at you, so yeah. Throwing bananas around. Ah, right, and there it is. He, uh, if he was a little faster, he would be able to punish that uh, banana yep. pole. Uh, being cute ain't gonna help you here. Nope. <laughs> oh wow. my god. Uh, I think he was going for a Z drop, but uh, he's gonna get yeah. something with it. Not much. Good forward tail out of shield. Grab. Oh. Just a hair away and passing right by him. Yeah, I see that Kaizen's um, trying to keep a distance. I notice he's staying like air. Yeah. In the air a lot. Good SDI from that OP. I don't even think that was SDI. Really? Sometimes people just fall out of stuff. And then we give him too much credit. I don't think that was SDI at all. <laughs> I think he won. No, no, no. Oh! Wow. Oh, I would have just did something crazy right there. I think Helper wanted to put instead. Oh, that banana is actually gonna per cancel the lag from the jab. Kirby's um, fin jab finisher is super laggy. Because he does like a little pose. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Being cute, man. That stuff doesn't help you. Yeah, nope. <laughs> Can't be cute. All the best characters aren't cute. Actually, no. Shut up. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus. 
Hold on, I'm surprised he didn't down to up smash. What the? Grounded down B. Yo, that's crazy. Oh, Bates. Why are you up throwing now? <laughs> okay. Oh my god, he's so slow. He like started running that way before Diddy even monkey flipped that he couldn't catch him. Yeah. Like the monkey flip went faster than him. That's so that's like ridiculous. I, I I'm interested if um like helper did the smash monkey flip, but I wonder if he does the tap monkey flip instead. Maybe he'll catch up. He goes a little higher for the tap one, right? He... I know he definitely travels slower. Like this. Yeah, he definitely travels slower and shorter. I, I think he goes a little bit higher. I'm not sure. Yeah, I don't know either. Who cares about Diddy? Yeah, good jump away. He was waiting for you to drop your shield and throw the banana up. Oh my god, I'm throw that inside the banana. Yeah. Oh, the Kirby's so freaking adorable, man. <laughs> just like looking at him. Like, just look at his little face. Never mind. Yeah, you can't see it anymore. Yeah, Helper's gonna take game one. Kirby looks like he doesn't even know he's in a fight. How can you hit this thing? I wouldn't be able to hit him. <laughs> Helper just like made everything yeah. worse. Oh, no, 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 yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Like, you want to talk about cute, Luna is. Bowser. Bowser. Marshall not happy about that. Mm -mm. Get off this character, you fraud. <laughs> I'm going to pick up Bowser. I want to play a bad character who has something cheesy. Isn't that funny how Smash has that? Like, bad yeah, characters that's, that's that have cheesy pretty interesting. Things. Yeah. That's, like, weird. Yeah, we, it's called a gimmick. A good gimmick. It's a good gimmick. A gimmick that beats zero. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so if that's the case, you can do it for free, right? Yeah. Maybe. <laughs> you don't have to pay for anything. Yeah, I never heard of upsets. That's the case. Just win everything. Why Why do you get anything but first? Oh. Mm. Shots, mm. man. Shots. Mm. Mm. We're we getting crazy out here. Like, you know what they say. The truth hurts. We're getting crazy. Are we actually going to the stage or bun and check? I, I think guess. we're going here because you know this is this guys this guy's are random. Yeah. The best soundtrack in the game. Are you serious? I guess we're playing this. Yo, why don't I ever listen to this when I'm trying to sleep at night? <laughs> this is the That's most a good yeah. peaceful. Like I'm not even complaining. I'd rather hear this than Smash Bros. music. No no funny. But I feel like I'm I'm by a small pond laying on the grass. This is amazing. Who cares about this fight? Let's yeah. all chill. Let's just relax. Yeah, just relax. Just and breathe. Play. Yeah, people are very tense in their matches. Just listen to this. You'll feel better. This is amazing. Why'd they put this in the game? Bro? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is better than Smash Bros. music. I don't care. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I bet that. How can you act? Like, you really think about it? We fight to that song. The Smash Bros. music, like, we fight to that. Is he gonna die? I would actually be upset. Yeah, I've, I've <laughs> no, not yet. I think he was now like five percent shorter. But it doesn't matter. Yeah, that trade's gonna hurt him. It's funny how like even without the up throw up air, I think Bowser's still better than Kirby. <laughs> like <laughs> he's actually faster than him. That makes no sense. So are we trying to turn around grab or was it up B it looks like? Oh, walk away? Oh, but he could have just like up smashed him. Oh, yeah. Walk. I like that walk away. Kirby's freaking cute, man. <laughs> just walk away. <laughs> oh, can't hit me. Oh! Down All right. Low. Now he gave, his, Turn he up. gave him enough Turn up. rage. Go chase him. Go chase. All right. He gave him enough rage to kill with up throw. Man, we ain't scared of our age. Let's go. Now up throw's not killing. You're not fussing with nothing. Ah, uh, he, he did oh it. He did it. Oh my god. Let's go. Mind game. Helper is so smart. He is so smart. I, like, I would be happy if he loses this, but nah. That, that's guaranteed. I said not gonna work and it worked. <laughs> we just make it look stupid at all. See, yeah, Helper taking it 2 0. Oh. <laughs> ah, damn. That, that was a nice piece of music right there. I feel so relaxed. Yeah.
I feel like John Number should play on the stage, so I can actually just sleep when I watch him play now. <laughs> yeah, Marshall, he, he he probably played that match better than you did. Woo! Yo, we getting crazy. <laughs> Yo. Oh, damn. Right, oh, gonna, I'm if sorry, If you're not going to defend yourself, then just get out of here. You're going to make sorry. everyone feel bad. Damn. I like when people fight with me. <laughs> I don't like when people agree with me when I'm talking. Talking my smack. Yeah, man. He's a he's a helper's a bully that fails at bullying. I try to spike him and it didn't work. <laughs> the bully that tries to pose you against the locker but hurts his hand instead. <laughs> <laughs> That's what he is. <laughs> try to bully him and he just killed himself and saved him. Like. <laughs> oh, I know. <laughs> so we're gonna have Soen and Bonkai. I don't know what round this is right now. I don't have the bracket in front of me, and I'm too lazy to do it. I don't care. Yeah. Worry about you. All right, so that is. That does smash is, like, the only good thing I see with that is it's spot fast. dodges. Yeah, it lasts a long time. It's a good anti air though. I'll give it that. Yeah, that too. That too. But, like, if you want to commit to that. OK. Yeah, you can't punish that. It's safe. Yeah, her stuff is pretty good on shield. Ooh. The problem with her is that you know it's coming. She ha this character has like no mix-ups in her. Ooh, Back I thought that again. was an up air. I think up air would have hit him. Really wide. All right, so actually we just saw Stone versus the yeah. before. So let's see what Bankai, if he brings anything different to the table or he's going to succumb to the same fate. And we'll call Zone the CSS killer. Like compared to Sneaky, Bunkai is spacing a lot better. Like poking his shield better. I just don't think he's letting Sun press buttons for free anymore. Yeah, no. I think he was letting him do a lot of that. He, don't have, he doesn't have a jump. He's CSS really good at recovery. That was oh, really I good. I respect that. I, I, I respect wow. that. Wow. I like that. Let's go. Yeah, Saipi has um, sending it's people a big out of the So yeah. You can't just come through that. Oh, you're just going to get dashed at. Shut up. <laughs> Stupid little side B. That's cute. Dash tag. No jump, but he's going to get back to the stage before him. All right. So Bankai is looking pretty good. Mm -hmm. And now losing the lead by one percent. Never mind. It's funny how like ZSS is like a power character. Yeah. Isn't that hilarious? Yeah, that's actually balancing, guys. Balancing. That's balanced. Oh, that's balanced. He made her miss. I like it auto aimed at her leg <laughs> instead of her body and it missed and he just back her again because of it. So yes, uh Bunkai playing that a lot better than uh Sinky did. He's not like he didn't drop any punishes, like the hard ones. Like that was a quick punish. I know he didn't send that to make that side be miss and get the Sometimes back you just gotta keep your game simple. Yeah. Like how easy is that to actually just press side B and set anything else? That was amazing. I actually really like that. Yeah, I hope Sinky saw that. Side B, back air. That's all he did. He didn't do nothing flashy. Keep it simple. Whoa. All right, now Son is like just tight. Come side B me again is what Son is saying. Can you land? Can you land? Can you land? Yes, ah, you can. I'm missing the air dodge. He almost had it. Yeah. Ike is like going to kill you. Oh, yeah. Yo, like that's so slow, but it hits people. It's so slow, man. Let me try to throw something like that and I'm gonna get punished. Oh yeah. How do people get away with that? That's like an art. Oh, side B. What are you doing? Side B. Oh, oh, oh yeah. he almost, almost had almost, it right almost. there. Yet if he was a little further away. Oh, back throw? <laughs> wow. <laughs> Yo, Bankai is amazing me right now. What a prodigy. He's actually amazing me right now. He just love tapped him to death. Ooh, not getting the air dodge. But oh, that's guaranteed. Alright. Can you land? Can you land? Yes, you can. Every time I say it, it works. Oh. Is he gonna, like, up tilt again? We chic out here. <laughs> up tilt. Just up tilt. Just do it, man. <gasps> oh. Up B. Yep, he caught that. I, like, sense a dash attack. I don't know why. 
I just feel like he's just gonna get dash tag. Oh, he's gonna get fared instead. I still sense it. Watch this up tilt. Watch this up tilt. Watch this up tilt. Dash tag. Come on, do something. I'm saying. Oh. How did he get away with that? I don't know. Okay, back here. He actually got away with that. Oh yeah. Yo, Ike is such a good guy. Oh, yeah. He actually didn't kill the animals in this game. This guy. We need more people like Ike. You like Ike. I want Peter to be like Ike. <laughs> but he spent the entire game and not killing any animals. <laughs> Alright, so we're actually going to go to Town and City. Um, Bankai didn't really kill off the top. It was mainly just edge guards. So Yo, all guys, edge guards have like been making me happy. Oh yeah. Oh, that sucks. <laughs> like that move. He just hit him with like one little hit and then he just dropped out. Oh, tech chase with the side B. Oh, I'm like yeah, the use of side Yeah, he's B been here. doing that. It's really, it's actually pretty good. If, especially the way he positions himself. If they um tech rolled in, it would have still hit. Yeah. Oh, but I mean, that's just what ZSS likes. But that's not gonna kill him. Ike's yet. a big boy who fights for his friends. Oh, back here. Oh, oh I thought no he was punish. Back again. He could have. <gasps> How do people not punish these laggy moves? I don't get it. But I throw something safer than that and then they punish me for it. Actually, Side B has like no lag at all. Up tilt? See what she said? He's up tilt? He perfect shoots with the up tilt and then didn't do anything. Oh, you're talking about him. Oh. Oh my god. Oh my god, what are you doing? You psycho. Oh, side B! Side B again. I I think that's my, my favorite move is Yoshi Samus now. Oh, no punish. Yep, you guys. Oh. He's trying to get in, but... Ike is blocking him well with his distance. Oh, that's side B. Yo, I'm actually, that's actually an option. I respect that from Bankai, but now we're even if we're set. Oh yeah, my so god. ZSS does not have to worry about that. And that force still super strong. But not All right, now if Ike just touches you, you're going to die. Yeah. I actually saw impressive stuff from both players. Oh, yeah. Side B games. I really like, I really like Bankai's offstage game. This entire set. Oh. Now I'm about to be mad biased. Get ready, y'all. Oh, Get great. ready, y'all. This is why y'all don't let me commentate. DA. We got my man, Josh. Oh, look, look, look at him right there. How, look how he walks up with so much confidence. He's not even going to take his bag off. He's just going to play. <laughs> look, look, press, pressing that sync button. Staring at his opponent down. Oh, wait. He uses pro control and never noticed. Oh yeah, you don't know about my man right here. And right, we all gonna take off the bag with the mix-ups all day. <laughs> Let's go. Hey, borrow his his pro controller. Yeah, that shirt is actually mad dope. Where do you get that shirt from? Right? What is, what is it even? It's just, no, I'm talking about Jasper's shirt. Yeah, I know. Actually, what's, what's Main Wolf's shirt? That shirt looks pretty cool too. I'm gonna guess Fox. It looks like Fox. It looks like a Fox skeleton, right? Yeah. I like that, we kill foxes out here. Throwing shots. Oh, no, no, no. Nah. Like Throwing shots. Don't, don't do it. Throwing shots. We kill foxes out here. <laughs> so yeah, uh, his tag right there is main. I don't know if he goes by that. These guys rocking the cool shirts. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Whoever loses has to give up the shirt. <laughs> oh, no, no. Whoa. You see, you could have done that in summer, but now, now it's getting cold outside and you want to do yeah, that. Yeah, so you better play. <laughs> came here to play. Oh, we got Link versus Toon Link. Oh, wow. Interesting. I feel like this I should have been seeing before, but I don't feel like I've seen this before. Now, you see Link and Toon Link on the same guy, but this is just two separate players with Links. Right? Whoa. Come on, swing it. Now, oh, one, up tilt for up tilt. One thing about this matchup. Why are these guys not throwing things? Why are they fighting with their swords? I don't know. They're playing wrong. <laughs> oh, up throw. <laughs> this guy just did bomb to his ear. Yeah, he didn't think the bomb would hit, actually. I'm seeing all these players do some stuff I've never seen before. Oh, my God. 
Can we talk about how both of these characters are stronger than they're supposed to be? That hurt. That was yeah, a three-piece no. combo, and he only touched him once. Two projectiles and a sword. That's crazy. Dash attack? Yes. That was a pretty bad OB. I don't know what was going on there. Stop that. Stop smashing. Yeah. Um, the bomb is actually going to be um, each of their projectiles. Yeah. Yes. Because it's considering an item. Items win most projectiles. That boomerang took a long time to come back. Yep, oh, he bomb. just ran up on him. Link, Link. is heavy though. Yep. Go. He read the jump, but he didn't read the jump away. These two characters have like the scariest forward smashes. Not, like, not, not when it is, hits. It's just when it hit your shield. Yeah, because like, is he gonna do the second one? Should I drop shield? I don't know. And then when you realize he didn't do the second hit. Oh, safe clear. now. And then if you like fuck up and then he kills you at like 50 with it. Now, what I know about Link is that um, if he if he has a second jump and he upbees and gets hit out of it, he loses the second jump for some reason. I don't know. If yeah, a lot of characters like that. Greninja's like that. Oh, really? Yeah. I didn't know that. Oh, wow, that's sad. me. <laughs> I'm too nice. So it don't even matter. Oh. Oh, so Link's Bomb just beats two Link's Bomb. I think it's because uh, Jash soft threw it and... No, I think it's because of bullshit. Okay, yeah. It's just bad programming, man, I'm telling you. Yeah, That's beating, actually funny. Yeah, beating out uh, two Link's projectiles. Oh, that would have been pretty nice. Oh. 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 Jash has brought this back. They both have bomb in hand. <laughs> this bomb just beats it. Oh, that was... Oh, my God. That was so... Oh, I guess it wasn't it, because up there wasn't going to kill you. Up throw's not going to do it. Oh, I thought he was going to back throw to the bomb. Ah! Yeah, no, nah, that wasn't going to connect. Up throw will kill at this point. Link's up throw. Oh, ah! that four... Damn, that was strong. That's what I'm saying. And that's that's three, right? Yeah, I don't know the numbers. So. It's one of those moves that has no hit stun and is so strong. Like Corrin's upper is like that too. Like, there's no hit stun really, but then that move is so strong. Alright, Main Wolf taking game uno. Mm -hmm. Main Wolf feeling himself, he's bobbing his head. Oh, now he's not feeling himself, he's tight. What happened? Are you FD. Tight? FD? Yeah, we're gonna go to FD game two. Both pull out bombs, I knew it, let's go. Yeah, I forget Cloud Gentleman Limit. This is better. <laughs> wow. I was also actually going to hit him when he's trying to run away. Oh my god. Yeah, he noticed that. I think he noticed that he didn't have to jump. Now he doesn't have to jump again. Yeah, let's smash from Link. It's really good at catching air dodges. Yep. Yep, there it is again. Now Link is a little too slow to follow with Pharaoh. Wow, dash tag. Yeah, ja good stuff on Jash for focusing on getting himself back on stage. Better than just try to do something funny. Throw, I just want to steal back throw. Yeah. I see a lot of two links do that, and, I, and it really bugs me. And it makes no sense, yeah. Yeah. Ooh, he almost had um, the invincibility drop. Alright, so it looks like Josh is playing the You Can't Catch Me game. Yeah. That boomerang hit him, and then took the bomb out of his hand and threw it off stage. Optimal. Ooh. Yep, bomb so, there. Something funny I noticed about this. When, whenever they see a bomb explode, if they're not paying attention to the facts, they're going to be like, okay, so who's, who bomb blew up? Yours or mine? I don't know what you mean by F8. 
Oh, that's what it is, so... Yeah, that so, now smash just has a weird angle. Oh, it's a little slow on that punish. Oh, jump. So jump I just too. hit this. Oh. All right, gonna get the down smash huh. now. <laughs> I think that. No, uh, no, no, no. Tilly was a little, was a little too high to follow up with a That's too much for me right now. All right, good fast fall on the ledge. Jump a lot. I feel like Josh is just like you can't land. This FD choice, I think I know why Mayo is tight. You can't land. He's just whiffing. Oh wow, that actually got him off stage. Oh, that up air pulled the trigger a little too late. Back throw is gonna do it. You know, like, Twin Link's back throw is OD. Mm -hmm. Why? He's just like, I don't know, like, it's like a leg toss, but like, it really throws you that far. You know, he, you're telling me he can throw Bowser that far? Yeah, and he's just a kid. And then Link is just like, what are you doing? Kick him. What are you doing? Look what Twin Link can do with his throw, and then look what you're doing. Where are we gonna go? Battlefield. Like, pretty much the opposite of FD. This is like the furthest you can get away from FD. Yep. Boomerang, you're the MVP. I agree with the choice because Main Wolf could not land. Mm -hmm. And now he has options. But I always feel like Battlefield favors the faster character. Yes. I always feel like that. Yep. And you're not faster than Tumi. Alright, good tech chase. Wow, that jab just stuffed that death attack. Alright, so that's pretty interesting. I don't know if he was trying to SCIing or anything, but uh, us smash is not really going to get all three hits if Jash just jumps immediately. Yeah, it makes sense. I feel like you're going for something a lot harder than Bob Bear. Bob made Josh's bomb blow up. Yeah, the first hit of Link's forward is actually OD. Mm -hmm. Alright, good bomb to fair. To Link regular. Oh, almost got him with second hit. Bomb yep. up there. Nice recognition. It's hard to tell which way you're gonna fly when you, when you throw like point black like that. Yeah, props to that. Is it a zero to recover? No, he's not. Yes, he is. What the? The bomb like hit his shield and then he rolled? Yeah. I don't understand this at all. He perfect shield and rolled. I hate when I get that and I don't want that. Yeah. Buffers. You could just hear the, the bombs. <laughs> yep, cooking bombs all day. Josh? It's like, yo, when Josh gets momentum, it's like, Main Wolf has no answer. Like, Main Wolf plays neutral wrong, but then it's like, he gets hit, and then they're like. Then hits on the arrow. <laughs> nice anti air. And up there, lasts forever, so. He's gonna catch him. Nice recognition to get again. Who's gonna take it? Oh wow, he actually had to catch his boomerang, which ruined all of his frame. Frame trap. Oh, Jumped right onto that bomb. Oh, oh. Ah, I think he Why a bomb fair. there? Why there? That's yes. gonna do it. Perfect. Yep. Yeah, Link can do that. Very good for Main Wolf. Gonna take it over Josh. Give him a shirt, Josh. Yep, yep. That was nice. Now, I'm kind of glad you didn't win full bias on this one. You would have looked dumb as hell. <laughs> I try not to. Uh, sure. I'm not oh, no, I'll, I'll, I'll about to drop out right now. Oh, yeah. Alright, All right, so. Play sometime soon. I haven't played like an hour. Oh, yeah, 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 sure. Alright, I'll, I'll stay, I'll stay. Mm -hmm.
Oh, good. Oh, well, I think it has a match right now, actually. But yeah, uh, guess he's back with me on commentary. Uh, actually, I was a little early on that. But, uh, well, you get to try commentating with different people, so. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. Um, hey! How you doing? <laughs> Hey, so Salty Fun once again joining you here on the mic, and we are going to now be getting to Kill Sage versus Davivi. Um, Fight. So I know I so to Kill Sage earlier was playing Sheik as you saw. Yeah, Sage. yeah. His oh my god, I would so much rather fight this Fox than this. That's Sheik. a fact. Yeah, his, because his, he can't just like go off Sage against you like as as easily as Sheik does. Or in general, just the glass cannon aspect, you know? Yeah. Like it's like definitely scarier at all times to fight against Sage's uh, Fox. But at the same time it's like there there I feel like I have A room to breathe. Yes. B moments where I can smother him yep. and see the potential to kill really early. Yep. Uh, yep. against a Sheik it's none of that. It's just like you're smothered, but like you hit him and he bouncing fishes, and you're like, well, yeah, got that young 12%. Anyway, but I don't think we're gonna be seeing Sheik. We are. Sheik does well against Falcon. So hey, what? Maybe playing Falcon? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, let's watch that on the instant replay. What? Look at Sage's face. <laughs> Alright, this shit again. <laughs> Hold on a second. All right, so this is a match. All right. TV so, and the Kill Sage. Yeah, so um, this match is, So the thing is that I was going to say Sheik versus Lucario, who is normally PB's main, is a weird one. Because Sheik technically should never, ever lose a neutral or let Lucario do anything. Yeah. But the fact that Sheik struggles to kill means that, you know, Lucario then back hits her at 20 and she dies. However, this matchup is entirely different. Uh, once again, Sheik can be really oppressive on Falcon, despite his speed. Uh, and on top of that, the edge guarding that Sheik has on Falcon nullifies for a big first, like for a considerable amount, her inability to kill. Mm -hmm. Um, and one thing I, um, we, I saw earlier is that uh, Vivi was tr going off stage trying to edge guard Sheik, but up tilt's a lot better. If he if he bouncing fish right right above the ledge, it's gonna hit, and, and she'll probably die to that. So I have a question: Does crouching Sheik crouch under Falcon's grab? I think so. That's silly. Unle yeah. Unless it's her elbow elbows that are that makes the grab happen, but at that height, it wouldn't hit. Ooh, goes to the hard read on that air dodge, but. VP not going to bite, and now VP is alive at 134. That's a whole lot of rage, but at the same time, oh, the kill stage actually with the air dodge, but didn't quite get there in time, and that will be no, um, nope. Oh, and this is gonna be it again with the 50-50. VP guesses right, He's staying alive again. Guesses right, ah, yeah, caught on the landing. And like, I wonder if it's like out of BB. Oh. <laughs> that was not rarely hitting ever, but um, he's gonna get it. Um, what I was gonna say is that uh, I think BB was like reacting that Sage was stalling. Yo, these combos? Oh no, jump! Is he done? Nope. Okay. Yeah, he chose to recover higher, so it's gonna help him get back on Sage. What? A that was such an amazing bait from BB. Just spacing at this really nice range, throws out the back air, which does auto cancel, and throws out the F smash, just completely outranging the Kill Sage's option, closing out that stock. It's also safe on shield. No. Yeah. Forward smash is safe on shield. Oh no, no, no! Saying back air because like if he oh back air, if yes. he back air into shield and Sage is trying to go tries to go aggressive, he could just pivot, like perfect pivot to uh, forward smash. It will definitely or, like, hit perfect him. Perfect pivot jab even. But regardless, right now we do have BB once again. He's at this crazy high percent perfect while Sage is sitting shield. pretty low. BB has been guessing so well on those 50 50s. It's really impressive. But at the same time, to Kill Sage, it doesn't even matter because to Kill Sage is just keeping him off stage in a bad spot. Ooh. Guesses it right that time, but. Is that going to be it? Yes, right there. He actually didn't DI that correctly at all. I think he would have lived. Like earlier, he lived for uh, at 162. Uh, I think he was closer to the blast on that time now. Probably, yeah. Either way, know. Sage is going to take a game one. I, I don't think uh, VV switching. I think VV. I think VV. I understand the sort of appeal of going Falcon in the Saturday bracket entitled, Why Don't We Just Have a Zeno, Guys? Is there a guys in the title? 
No, you imagine that. Oh, okay. Although I probably should put in a <laughs> why not? Why do we just have a Xeno, guys? <laughs> Alright, so oh okay, so Vivi's actually gonna switch back to Lucario. Yep, and not only is he switching to Lucario, he's counterpicking to Battlefield, which gives Lucario even more crazy survivability. And the kill stage is probably not going to be he still might be able to do it. Uh, oh that's a really unfortunate stop What a great loss. game. <laughs> That, that was totally game. Vivi's fault, dude. Yeah. That's 100% yeah. controllable. That was Vivi's fault. Yeah, man. That's the, oh, I don't have as much aura as I thought I did because I got slapped by this character five times. That does 10% total. Ooh, but at the same time, even when Lucario loses a super early stock like that, you cannot count him out. There is the Anubis strat, even in singles, where when Lucario is down a stock against his opponent, he actually gets to max aura quicker. <laughs> It's a little bit complicated, but for the most part, I think the percentage is uh, 130. I don't know. John knows the numbers perfectly, but I, I'm not 100 percent sure. It's John. a uh, it's a multiplier on your aura. I think it's like 1.3 for each stock you're behind. Also, Anubis is generally only in terms of uh, single and doubles. Yeah. The idea of it's Anubis not, is yeah. that your teammate is stock tanking for you to give you that extra aura. Yeah. So in this case, it's just a little bit of a help for VV. He's definitely hitting harder than he normally would. That uncharged Aura Sphere almost took out to Kill Sage's stock. And yeah, the Kill Sage has to be fearful. Because even though he has the stock lead, uh, unless he's able, like, because he needs to make sure that he t gets the, the actual KO. And if yeah. he doesn't, all of this percent is actually worth less than nothing. All right. And Ouch. Yeah, really nice there. VB shielding that attack is going to end up getting the um, force pump for the kill. And now we see VB at 113%. Sage at zero. What a beautiful trump. And that was so clean from the kill Sage, but it's not going to do it just quite yet. You know, I wonder if, like, Lucario Mains has, like, the biggest composure ever. Because, like, they're like, okay, look. I'm at like 100 less high, higher than this guy, but I'm still in this. Oh yes, no, I, I definitely see that. Because they, they deal with last hit situations like every single game. Yep. Oh, no attack, but he's, he's, he's gonna a make lot it back. Aura. But the amount of lag on that uppy will do it. All right, so Sage is taking it too well. I don't know if Vivi's gonna like grind up his Falcon. I think that match was uh, played a lot better for BB than the first game. First game was closer though, I thought. Oh, really? Yeah. And I have bad memory. <laughs> well, I mean, the thing is that, that game, first game was closer in terms of end product. Yeah. But that game, uh, you know, he did have the SD very early on and also, you know, he is Lucario, which means him with, you know, high aura is much dangerous. So technically, so VV was closer to winning that game too, but yeah, never mind. <laughs> I just answered my own. You know, he, he just died, that's it. Oh man, I just gotta say, you you guys can't see it, but there is Helper's Dog. Oh my uh, god, Helper's Dog is going up to watch yeah. him on stream! Oh my god, I'm crying. Oh, why can't I have a dog like that? I'm crying. I do have a dog like that, but he's not here right now. Yo, yo, bring him so I can play with him. Oh. Like, I can't have a dog at my house, but I want, and I really want a dog. Yo, can we put Helper's Dog on Helper's lap? Yeah, he actually put the, he actually turned the, uh, the camera onto uh, Luna. I think he's doing that right oh, now. Is he doing it right now? Oh, is he doing it right yeah, now? I actually want to see if Helper got oh, the angle. Man. Oh! Oh! Sage, please switch the camera. The player no, cam, please. Switch the player it. cam. Oh, she's giving him the. She, he's actually just doing it. He's actually just. I. I, I didn't think you were doing it. Oh, oh, Venia, how can you fight this man? How? You became the ultimate villain. You're literally beating up yeah. a guy with a puppy right now, if you if you even try. Oh, yeah, man. she's four years old. Luna? Yeah, she's four years old. Okay, so uh, uh, I realize the dog might be four years old, but it looks like a puppy. That is the most puppy-looking dog I've ever yeah, seen. Yeah, bro. Okay, look. This is what's going to happen. You're going to be on your own in commentary. I'm going to just look at Luna. Look at her. Oh my gosh. And she's very clearly distracting Helper. Yeah. But Walking like, away. honestly, it's worth it. Absolutely worth it. Ooh. Oh, wow. That was amazing spacing from Venia. Helper now off stage. That was a really smart recovery, but Venia is still able to actually uh, cover that option. Yeah, good stuff on saving his jump also when he was getting shurikened on. 
really nice, but he hasn't managed to get out of the corner yet. Oh, Benny looking really strong, but that's a nice up throw down air from uh from Halper right there. Okay, nice side B going to add on a little extra percent right now. Helper actually not really opting for banana use. Oh, he lands on the ground with that fair. The <laughs> lag from him. <laughs> I'm just looking at Luna. <laughs> I want to. I want to so much. Oh, that, that, was that wall clean was not what he desired. No, he's not. He's going to make it back. Watch. <laughs> just look at him. <laughs> he's like, hey, hey. Oh, okay. <laughs> I actually just want to say, I never realized this. Diddy Kong's free for all animation is it's hilarious. It's one of my favorites in the game. My third favorite animation in this game. What's your first? Uh, duck Hunt Dog when he runs off a ledge. Easy. Like, honestly, guys, if you've never seen it, like, play Duck Hunt and just run off of the stage. <laughs> it's... No other character has that kind of animation. Oh, look, Luna's sleeping. She's... God. Oh, and help her starting to do better now. Yeah, because he doesn't have a... Because <laughs> he doesn't have a dog walking his way. I'd be, I'd be distracted if that happened, but... All right, Benny's going to take game one. Whatever. Oh, is he? He's not even gonna throw her off. Mm -mm. Oh. Nah, good she's dog. the good luck charm. She's the good luck charm. What a good dog. You know what we should do? We should put Luna on Venny's lap. Yeah, I want to see what happens. I want to see how hard he can resist. <laughs> Cause I know I wouldn't. I would put down my controller. Uh, uh, yeah, if, if I was like, if I was still in booty, if I was playing, if if Luna comes over here when we're playing, I'm you're on your own, buddy. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm so I don't care about no tournament. <laughs> There's a dog in front of me. I'm petting it. Oh, yeah, right. Helper's are gonna switch to Cloud. I I definitely agree with the counter pick. Um, overall, I don't. I honestly don't. I think like Benny, his track record with Diddy is not as good as as it was with Cloud. Uh, that is true. But honestly, and I mean, maybe this is just my thinking because I saw like you know Luna was a factor in terms of. Uh, interference yeah, but that now she's resting game. on his arm. But like already, we're actually seeing a bit of a stronger start from yeah. Helper. Um, and the big reason why is because I feel like Helper actually couldn't even use Diddy's best tools. He didn't get That's the true. chance. That's true. Like Venia wasn't giving him room to pick banana. You know, he was like punish. He was just outspacing him really effectively. Um, and Cloud is a lot harder to outspace. Granted, you know, Venia is extremely good at this game, and this character can outspace Cloud, but it requires. Oh, that's unfortunate. Yeah, he must have looked at Luna for a second and then like, oh, I have limit already. Ooh, nice and sweet spot on the ledge there from Helper. He still has his jump. Oh, and it helps wow. him get back on stage. I don't yeah. know why that reverse. It's because uh, Venia went off stage and just went straight. And Helper was more into the stage than, than Benia, so it's actually going to push him towards the stage. It's really specific on how the Hydro Pump hits. It sends you at a certain angle. Yeah, all right. And so right now, oof. Yeah, oh, he, he was definitely not making it back. He charged up limit. He was, uh, he, he was like less than half. No, he was very close to really? limit. Really? Uh. Yeah, I'm, I'm fairly certain. I saw him charge it up and he was almost there. There's too but much anyway, blue in here. Yeah, I think he was just like nervous about, you know, whether he'd be able to land it. And even then, Venia still has the potential to edge guard it with the cloud with Hydro Pump. Um, so right now, yet so Helper looking for his opening at the moment. When oh, Venia is just being so mobile right now, just not putting himself in one place. Oh, he doesn't have a jump, but he yeah, makes it back make it fine. Back. He air he air dodged, so he got his air speed back. Yes. Oh, yeah, that's gonna take it. Oh, he's oh man. There it is. He has a dog on his slapping. You're gonna do that to him? Are they doing an emergency best best three out of five? Game one didn't count because Luma. Oh, they're talking probably about the limit when you burn limit by accident. Yeah. It was worth it though. Huh? You got to see Luma. Yeah. Oh, that dog is. Oh. Oh my lord. Ah. Makes me envious as hell. I have. A, oh man. I have a very good dog at home. Yeah, what kind of dog you have, man? What I kind have of dog a, you have? He's a mix of uh, black lab and terrier. So imagine the body of a lab, like body of a black lab and terrier face. So he's got that scruff. <laughs> also, he is, um, he's a bandana dog. 
bandana. He's a bandana dog. As in, like, I, I you know, I, I had him for, we had had him for several months. All of a sudden, one day, I'm looking at him on the couch, and he's, like, looking at me with those sad eyes. And all of a sudden, I'm just like, yo, what if we put a bandana on you? And ever since, he's, like, we actually got, like, a permanent bandana that wraps around his collar. Wow. And it's, he is some, he is a handsome, <laughs> handsome fella. Uh, man, that's goals. Help for your, Luna's goals, man. Luna's, go Luna's goals. I, I need I need a dog on my left when I play. I feel more more composed. <laughs> <laughs> my dog would actually do that, except my dog is much bigger. So I don't care, man. I don't care. I don't care if the dog's bigger than me. Please. All right. Like the way she was like resting on his arm and all. So right it's now, very comforting, but uh, I still wasn't able to do anything to Venya. I just need, I just don't know that matchup at all. Oh. Yeah, no, that matchup is. It's like so unique that if you don't play it on a constant basis, you can't really learn it. Like the one thing that I've noticed that works effectively is to shut down his like verticality. You know, he does a lot of full hops and that sort of thing. So sometimes just throwing out aerials and like, especially if you have the frame data for it, just throwing out aerials and like the space above him. Yeah. Kind of shuts down his just vertical movement. And uh, I'm actually unfamiliar with this player on the bottom here. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah so. oh, This is so right. Yeah, he plays so, like. Oh, is is it just going all chic today? I don't know. I, I I heard him say on Twitter that he's going back to having chic as a secondary. Aren't we all? Yeah, and so this matchup is actually, uh, it's a weird one, you know, as every chic matchup pretty much is, because you know when Ike, like when Ike hits hard, he is a big boy with a big sword. And Sheik, being so light, can drop extremely early stocks. On the other hand, Sheik's neutral is absolutely oppressive. And if at any point, uh, Son has to upbeat the ledge, yeah. the needles give him, like, oh, yes. hands. Oh, yes. Like, and, ooh. Especially if uh, Sage times the armor from the upbeat. Because Ike has armor on until he grabs the sword. Uh, well, so he has armor all the way in the bottom, but I'm saying, like, once, like, Sage can yeah, once stay he starts on rising, Sage, yeah. Stay on Sage, throw needles, and, like, because, like, the sweet spot for, uh, Uppy is, like, from what I've seen, it's not that great. Like, I, like, you know, Mega, who is in my crew, really nice there. Gets the cross up, actually, on that yeah. up air. BP Smash Dudes recently released a video about that. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You see it in action, yeah. Pretty, I'm surprised that video came out. It is a really um, long overdue kind of video. Uh, keep in mind that, like, you know, they were out of town. Yeah, yeah that's it, that's it. And also, like, I understand that they have certain, you know, they have a lot of videos that they want to do. Yeah. Oh, Ooh, really nice. Gets the raw back air there for some extra damage. Oh, he couldn't quite catch that roll in. But right now, just Sone is not finding his footing. The Sheik right now is absolutely devastating him. <laughs> when he has to land, there's a needle right there. Ooh, really nice there. That side B, when he lands for me with the aerial version, he does not have a lot of Yeah, no, it's, it's as if he was landing the entire ground the whole time. No, here it is this time. Get out. Uh, I heard that. No. Random with customs. Yo, that, that was, was an amazing nice read. That was a snipe right there. My, my vote's for 3v3. As long as I can find a crew. I don't want to do 3v3 and then have to, like, not. <laughs> you know what I mean? Uh, we're going to worry about that later because we have singles right here. Go home. Anyway, we're gonna go to Town and City. Like me, I think Battlefield would be a better pick than this, unless uh, Sage bans it for some reason. Like, it's still gonna be the same issue when the time when the stage transitions. So he, he's gonna he's gonna have a bunch of nails waiting for him. Oh no 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 no. No, 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 no. Okay, jank bracket, but with randoms and customs and equipment turned on. I'm, I'm about to get villager, man. 
Good catch with Snipey. And the air dodge read on the Vanish. Oh, I think he he should have be reversed, but he wasn't aware yeah, that we, he hit him. Can we not do low tiers considering that John Numbers is here? And I'm here too. <laughs> oh, is he not allowed to use Wii Fit? Okay, well, that's that's entirely different. Because because Wii Fit's a top tier when you play her. Yeah, man. Broken, broken character, man. Anyways, uh, Bouncing Fish gonna take the first stock. Forward tilt, forward tilt. I, I wonder if Sage is like gonna use perfect pivots. For this matchup, uh, I'm not sure, but I think it's really good. I mean, the reason why I think he might not... Are you talking about an advantage or defensively? Just in general, Sheik is a lot better with tilts. So Sheik's perfect pivots are really good, but it's really risky to do against Ike considering the range he has. Like, right. a lot of the times, like, perfect pivots are really good for that micro spacing. But when you're up against a character like Cloud, who just has amazing range, you perfect pivot out of his range, you can't really punish him. Yeah, no. Nah. Um, so, except for, like, Jap, maybe. Like, like, every I, I, other move he has, like... Yeah, but... It. Yep. Loses it, lot of his jump at that one point. Yeah. So, yeah, I think for this match, it would be better if he has it for aggressive... For aggressive situations, like the forward tilts. He can actually get more if he perfect pivot out of it. In between. Because um, people uh, want to SDI away from that, because it's a really hard...